it out. They moved to Canada to get away from the tabloids, but we can't <laughs> stop talking about them because they're so interesting. Yeah, we'll keep it respectful. The British tabloids, though, are all over this stuff, delving into every angle, every emotion, every look that uh, Harry has. He, just before 10, <laughs> arrived at YVR last night uh, from a British Airways flight, and then he reportedly got on a WestJet flight, took the 11 minute uh, journey over to Vancouver Island, and is now reunited with uh, Megan and little Archie. And uh, he just finished his, um, basically, his final engagement as a senior royal in Britain. And he gave that impassioned speech at that charity event in London where he was very specific about stepping away from the royal duties and, and going independent with Meghan. And um, there were some things in the tabloid saying that he looked really tired and agitated before he uh, touched down and then uh, was instantly, uh, his face lit up when he saw Meghan and little baby Archie. Well, that I can believe for sure. Oh, of course. Yeah, it's always nice to be reunited with the fam. Do you think the queen will be looking for a replacement? I wonder, yeah. yeah. Some big shoes like to we fill. Could, I feel like we could do that. <laughs> Let's put our application in, yeah. I've always wanted to be a part of the royal family. Hey, Queen, we heard that Buckingham Palace <laughs> is in disarray. We're on our way across the pond there. Yes, you would give the British tabloids something to talk about. <laughs>